Hello everybody, welcome back to this week's video. In this video, we are going to be doing a thrift haul. I've gone to the thrift store a lot in the past month, and so I'm very excited to show all of the treasures that I have found. And before we get started, I want to show you guys this outfit that I just finished making today from a 1967 Simplicity pattern that I found on eBay. And so without further ado, let's get started. So today I have a wide variety of different pieces to show you guys from hats to loungewear to pants to blouses to shirts and mostly all of the items that I'll be showing you are vintage items. And so that is super awesome because I found a lot of amazing pieces, which I was just so happy to find. And I also found a few pieces for Gray too. And I'm super excited for him to be able to wear them one day. So, and then I'll also do a try on for all of these pieces as well. Um, so yes, I hope you guys enjoy this video and love the pieces that I found just as much as I do. All right, so the first piece that I found is a skirt that I found today. I haven't ironed it or anything, it just came out of the wash, but I just love this pink and purple design on it. And it's much more pink um, out of the camera, but it has a very beautiful pattern on it and I'll probably have to um, Make it a bit tighter and also I'll probably want to shorten it as well But I just couldn't say no to this beautiful pink and orange combination I just love the colors and yeah, so I had to get this today And I just love the skirt I was super lucky today because it's also Savers Monday and so that's when they have the 50% off and so it's super rare to find really nice pieces on a Monday but today I found a whole bunch of leggings and so they're beautiful colors too like this purple here and then I found like this indigo purple bluish color. And then I found these maroon color. And then these beautiful forest green. And then a pair of these red tights. And then a lighter purple as well. And then also a, another beautiful color purple literally about like seven different tights that I found and I was like oh my gosh like this is awesome and so I was super super excited to find tights especially colored tights too because those are super hard to find especially at thrift stores but today I got super lucky and I found so many different types of tights and so yes those were awesome to find. The next item, I have this beautiful vintage mint green white detail dress. And I think it is so beautiful. I did trim it to make it a bit shorter. And so I have extra fabric, which I might make into a mask just so they can, you know, match if I want to wear um, the dress and a matching mask. It is so cute, the design too, like the squiggly white. So I love it, and then it just has a zipper on the back. So yeah, it's super casual, and you know, if I just wanna wear it on the go, I can just throw it on, and it's super cute, but still so fashionable. So for the next item, I have this beautiful, super groovy skirt. It wasn't even on a sale day that I went to the thrift store. And when I found this, sometimes the thrift stores price items like super expensive. This skirt was like $19, but then um, I had a few discounts on my account and stuff. So I was like, I can't leave without this skirt. And so it's so groovy. I love the design and pattern and just the different colors too. And it's not vintage, it's by the brand Loudmouth Ladies. 
And so I actually have another skirt by this company too, or this brand. And it's black with like a bunch of different squares on it, so that's super cute. And it also has pockets on the side. And yeah, I just love like the swirl. It totally gives me like an Austin Power vibe. So I was like, oh my gosh, like I'm so happy that I found this one. So yes. And I do need to, I do need to make it a bit tighter. The problem is, is the zipper is on the side and usually I would just take it in by the side. But now I'm not quite sure how to tighten it. So if you guys have any ideas, let me know. I was just gonna like pinch the back and kind of just sew down the back. But yes, yeah, so, so we'll see. And then the next item that I have is another skirt. And it is this vintage corduroy skirt with this fabulous paisley design on it. And it also has buttons going down the front. And this skirt was actually a knee length skirt. So it was super long. And I was like, I don't think I wanna keep it at this length. And so it also has pockets too. But anyways, so I made, took, when I shortened it, took the extra fabric and made a matching hat to it. So it's like super cute as a set. And I usually just wear like a brown shirt with it, with the hat and yeah, it looks great. So I just love it as well. Next piece that I'm going to show you guys, it was such a coincidence because I went to the thrift store and I looked in like the loungewear area, the sleepwear, and I found this beautiful vintage nightgown and it fit me perfectly and all of that. And so I bought it, went home, and then a few days after that, I went back to the thrift store and I was looking in the nightwear section and then I found the same exact like design piece and I was like, oh my gosh, like does my dress come with a matching like blouse like shirt and so I had to get it and so here it is so the dress is underneath where I bought the first day and then when I went back the other day it has a matching like top blouse to it and I was like that is so cute and so this is super comfortable to just lounge in after the shower just get into this and the blouse buttons up on top of the dress and then the dress has a zipper that goes down the front and it is super cute and I was like no way like I can't believe it it's a set so this was another good find and the pattern too is just so cute so 60s also so I was just very excited so this next piece, it's like a miracle that I found it. So it was on a Monday saver, so 50% off. And I don't know if you guys know the brand Rolas. I think that's how you pronounce it. But um, it's a brand out of Australia and they make a bunch of denim, like pants and bell bottoms and amazing pieces. And Usually they're super, super expensive because it's a small business and, you know, just denim as well. So um, I went to Savers, da 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 da, and I found these overalls, blue corduroy overalls from Rolas, the brand. And I like looked it up on their Instagram and I was like, no way, like, did I actually find like these overalls at Savers and then here are the overalls. So they're corduroy and they zip down in the front and they have this beautiful bell bottom pants to it. And so I'll show you the tag. Rollas or roll rollas. <laughs> And they're, they fit me perfectly, and I can't believe I got them for $5 at the thrift store when they're retailing for almost $200. And I haven't found anything that's wrong with them, um, so it probably had to do with like sizing and stuff, but I was just blessed. So this is the next item that I found. It's this cute little cutout in the middle, kind of like fancy, elegant dress. 
and I love the lime green and kind of like the shimmery silver embroidering that it has and I also love the cutout in the middle too I feel like it's just really 60s especially if you know you want to dress it up too you'd wear some leggings with it and all of that so yeah I just really love it and it's also a mini dress too so it's just super adorable and I can't wait to wear it out it's not vintage this one but I feel like it has a really like vintage look to it. All right, so this next item that I found, I went to Savers on a Wednesday, which I never really do. And I was so happy I did because I was doing my normal round around the thrift store and sometimes I do go into the men's section to look for gray. And so I was heading to the dresses and right at the corner of my eye, this beautiful blouse in the men's section was like the first one at the row. And I was like, no way, like I have to get this. All right, are you guys ready to see it? We just need a moment of silence for this blouse right here because it's the most beautiful blouse that I've ever found in the men's section. And it still had its original tags on it and everything. And I was like, oh my gosh. Like, I didn't even need to go look for anything else in the thrift store. Once I found this, I was like, all right, like this is all I need. And it fits him perfectly and it's super, super lightweight too so it's perfect for where we live and the weather and so i can't wait for him to wear it it is so cute next item i found this super adorable mini i believe it's handmade as well 60s mini dress look how adorable like, I love it so much, and I love the light blue background. These little pockets, too, that it has on the front, I just adore. And also the pattern of the fabric, too. I just love everything about this, and then it has a zipper down the back. And I just fell right away in love when I saw this on the rack. I got this today on Savers Monday. And I saw this dress a week before, so the last Monday I went, I saw it, I was like, okay, like, it's not my favorite vintage dress, but if it's still here next time, like, I'll get it, because it's still there. So I was like, maybe I was meant to buy it. And so it's this super cute, like, vintage dress. It looks like it's polka dot or just like black and white, but it has this really cool kind of like half circle half not circle design on it and the tag is so adorable it says chipper california that's the brand and i just love the um the font that it's in as well so cute and so i haven't tried it on yet because i got it today but I think it will look so elegant and beautiful and I don't know if I'll shorten it or not. We'll see once I try it on. Is this beautiful blouse that I found. It's not vintage. It is, I think, let's see. It's, okay, so it's polyester and spandex. It feels a little like silk, but Sadly, it's not, but I was super drawn to it from this beautiful pattern on it. The paisleys and also the combination of blue and green, I really love. Casper is the brand. Super cute and it's just adorable. It just has long sleeves with kind of like a bell ending to it. And so I thought it was adorable. So the next item I also found today, and it's this beautiful vintage dress or gown because it's a maxi dress. And it is totally out of the 70s. It's beautiful. It's only cotton, so here's the bottom of it. Super cute. And then the top of the dress 
is here. So it has these super cute, like a square neckline and just a um, straight edge to it with beautiful like strings coming down on the front and also the back too. So it's just so cute. I can't wait to try it on either because I haven't tried it on yet since I just got it today. So yes, I love. I have a few hats that I also got too. So I got this beautiful vintage hat and it's by a woman named Wendy Carrington and it was made in New York and I love the designs on it. It has paisleys right down here. So definitely cop that. I got this really cool like bucket hat, black and yellow. Super cute. Just pair it with an outfit. I feel like that'd be awesome. And then I also found this purple Sharon Tate hat. So I love it. I have now a red one a brown one and then a brown and striped orangish colored one and then now a purple one so i love it and it's also super cute you know to put in just as an accessory to some outfits all right so for the last piece of this video i got this vintage red velvet vest and it's actually made in Canada where I'm originally from and it is also it's not union made where is it it actually is union made but I guess the Canada Union and it has these beautiful also red velvet buttons that I just love and the whole vest is velvet and it is so beautiful it's a bit big for me but it doesn't look big so i'm not gonna touch it or like try and sew it or anything because i just love it and the tag says modern miss so how cute is that and then there's the union canada sticker so yeah just super cute i'm very glad i got to share all of the recent pieces that i have found at the thrift store I love sharing my passion for fashion with you guys because I just love the vintage style so much and it is just a thrill when I get to share the pieces with you guys. And I hope you guys have enjoyed this video seeing all of the most recent pieces that I've picked up at the thrift store. I should do more thrift haul videos so just let me know if you like these kind of videos and I will keep making them for you guys. And don't forget to check out my Depop where a lot of items I have put up, vintage and non-vintage, and also my Etsy. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram. And so thank you guys for sticking around and watching. And I will see you guys next time.